question 21. So, to differentiate, you multiply by the current power and reduce the power by 1. So with this first term, multiply by the 3, giving us 3x, and reduce the power by 1, so 3x squared. Similar with the second term, multiply by the current power, which is 2, 2 6 is a 12, and reduce the current power by 1, so not x squared, but just x. Right, part B. Uh, the curve with this equation has two turning points. Work out the coordinates of these two turning points, showing your workings clearly. Clearly, Well, at a turning point, that's where we've either got a maximum or a minimum, the gradient equals zero. And the differential allows us to work out the gradient at any particular point. So we need, we're solving where this equals zero. So 3x squared plus 12x equals 0. Fully factorizing, we get 3x, open bracket, x plus 4 equals 0. So our two turning points are at where x equals 0, because that makes this term 0, 0 lots of whatever is 0. And secondly, uh, x being minus 4, because that makes this bracket 0, 0 lots of 3x is also 0. So that's our x coordinates, 0 to minus 4. Now to work out the y values, we've got to substitute these x values not into the differential, but back into the original curve. So 0 cubed plus 6 lots of 0 squared plus 5 is 5, giving us 0 5. And substituting in the minus 4, minus 4 cubed plus 6 lots of minus 4 squared plus 5, minus 64, add 96, add 5 is 37. So our second coordinate, coordinate of a turning point is at minus 4, 37.